Hi there, students. To obliterate a verb. Obliteration, the noun. I guess obliterated, an adjective. Um, okay, to obliterate is just another word for to destroy. To wipe out, to leave no trace of something. To remove something completely. Um, to remove all signs of something. Either you destroy it or you cover it so that it can't be seen. Um, there were insults uh, spray painted on the wall and these were obliterated by black paint. Yeah, or they tried to obliterate these rude words by painting over them in white, but you could still see them through uh, the white paint, so they hadn't been completely obliterated. Um, the uh, the uh, view from the room uh, pointed towards the beach, but the view of the beach was obliterated by a tall tower block. Maybe somebody could drink lots of alcohol to obliterate the memory of something. Yeah, you uh, get drunk to obliterate painful memories. Um, I guess a, uh, a nuclear war could obliterate humans completely, could wipe them out. Yeah. Um, I think amnesia is when uh, things are obliterated from your mind. Yeah, they're eradicated. Um, okay, so to, to obliterate, to make something so that you can't see it. Yeah, um, to rem remove from existence, to make undecipherable, to make something imperceptible. Yeah, something that obscures it or wears it away. Um, the uh, beautiful paint had been obliterated by uh, time. Yeah, to quote Emily Dickinson, a dimness like a fog envelops consciousness as a mist obliterates a crag. Okay, so to obliterate, to uh, destroy completely, um, to you can obliterate a memory or a thought you just remove it from your mind yeah um, um maybe t well maybe time doesn't completely obliterate painful memories but certainly it uh, makes them less uh, poignant perhaps okay so to obliterate to uh leave no trace of something yeah um the uh, sign had been obliterated by uh, the smoke from the city. Yeah, um, yeah. A censor, when they censor a document, they completely obliterate parts of the document so that you can't read them. Yeah, the obliteration of certain words that are not. Um, acceptable perhaps. So to blot out, to make indecipherable, to efface as well. And this is the idea of to uh, obliterate, to veil, to hide, to obscure, um, to do away with, to eliminate, to extinguish, to get rid of. Um, so um, Yes, uh, ethnic cleansing very often tries to obliterate all of an ethnic group within a country, to eliminate, uh, to wreck. So the whole, the whole house or the whole village was obliterated by an enormous fire. The Great Fire of London obliterated many of the old wooden buildings. It eradicated them. Yeah? Um, so yes, to do away with, to put an end to. Um, yeah, I, wa I walked along the beach and uh, I left footprints in the sand, but then the tide came in and obliterated my footprints. Much of the East End of London was obliterated by bombing during the Second World War. 
okay so to obliterate as to formality I would give it a 5.5 in formality I think you could just about use it informally better semi formally writing or uh, spoken and you could use it formally without any problem um, this is a this is a good word for you to substitute for destroy or break yeah to completely obliterate um, I think you could use this as a vivid verb and then as to origin well it comes from Latin oblitero to blot out which actually comes from oblin oblino oblino um, which comes from ob across and limus mud so it's smeared with mud ob uh, oblimad um, to smear with mud so enough if you enjoyed the video give it a rating subscribe to my channel and I will see you soon bye for now obliterate obliteration